Hello, welcome to the weekly chart review. I'm Selena Nicholas, Technical Analyst at XM.com. Today is March 16th, 2016. Today we'll look at the commodity linked currencies, the Kiwi, Aussie and Canadian dollar. So the New Zealand versus US dollar, it remains neutral. It's been trading in a range between 0 0.6550 and 0.6766. Since the beginning of February, the 200-day moving average is strong resistance to the upside. If we look at the MACD, it hasn't really changed much. It's pretty much flat, although it remains above zero, so it's in bullish territory. If we look at RSI, it's just dipped below 50 into bearish territory, so it shows that downside momentum is in play since Monday. There is still chance then that prices could extend lower to 0.6550, especially if there is a daily close below the 50% Fibonacci level. Uh, this level is of the decline from 0.6881 down to 0.6346. So prices are currently testing this 50% Fibonacci at 0 0.6650. 13. Now, if prices uh, continue lower and break below the lower bound of the range, below 0.6550, this would bring the January 20 low into sight. This level is at 0.6346. Now, if we look at the Australian dollar, uh, the pair's upside momentum has stalled at an eight-month high of 0.7592. And if we look back from January, the pair has staged quite a strong rally, bouncing from 0.6826. The RSI uh, has turned down now, so this indicates that the upside momentum has weakened. Uh, also, MACD... Um, Although it is still rising, it's in bullish territory, which keeps the near-term bullish market structure uh, intact. So we, c we cannot say that there has been a shift in the bullish market structure yet. And this could be a slight correction unless prices break below 0.7384. This would be the top of the range. And if prices fall below this level, they just enter into neutral bias. You can see that prices were trading in a range from around October last year. So if we look at the Canadian dollar now, USD CAD. It's been consolidating around the 200-day moving average but the outlook remains bearish after prices have been steadily falling from the high of 1.4689. This was early January. The market has now retraced more than 61.8% of the up leg from the October uh, 1.2831 low to the high of 1.4689. So um, the 61.8 Fibonacci is now important resistance to the upside, 1.3539 to the downside. Support comes in at 1.3226, which is a 76.4% Fibonacci level. Thank you for watching and have a great day.